It's day two of the NFL draft, which means I'm sitting down with another player with Bozeman ties who's been drafted into the NFL. I sat down with Travis Dorsch, who was kicking into these uprights for the Hawks, and then he earned his way on to Purdue, where he was one of the most prolific kickers in their history before he was drafted in the fourth round of the 2002 draft. So you're kind of around the TV, you know, with your family and friends watching, and then your name doesn't get called, so you go back to doing what you're doing, eating, just you know, trying to avoid the nervous energy. Dorsch was a star for the Boilermakers. He was the first Big Ten player to be selected all conferences, as both a punter and a kicker. He still holds the record for most points in Purdue history and career field goals. He also won the Ray Guy Award for the nation's outstanding punter. Ironically, Guy played a huge role in developing him. Records come and records go. You know, there's a little pride there, of course, but it's not, it's not something that, you know, I go around talking about. But the star Purdue special teamer feels as though playing both positions might have hindered him just a bit when it came time to prepare for the draft. So in my preparation leading up to the combine and then even through draft day, I really sort of had to continue to do double duty and didn't really know what was going to happen. He was drafted in the fourth round to the Cincinnati Bengals in 2002. He still remembers the phone call he received from their special teams coordinator. And he says, you know, how would you like to be a Bengal? And I I don't even remember what my response was because I, I think I was just so shocked at the time because I, I hadn't done an interview with them. They didn't come to my pro day. Um, they didn't have me on site in Cincinnati, so I didn't really even know their coaching staff. After being cut by the Bengals after his rookie season, he had stints with the Packers, the Vikings, and then Minnesota's and the New York Giants NFL Europe affiliates. After a few years in Germany, he knew it was time for something else. I sort of knew at that point in time that, that the writing was on the wall, that I wasn't going to make it back you know, to the big team and uh, and and then pursued my, my current pathway, which is um, sport and exercise psychology. The 1998 Bozeman High graduate still remembers the kick that helped him get noticed by colleges, a 63 yarder while he was playing for the Hawks, which is a state record. That's I think when the mindset shifted to, okay, maybe football, you know, is going to be the meal ticket. He started kicking as a freshman for Bozeman after he won a tryout, but that season he played quite a bit of football. I was kicking on the varsity team. I was playing quarterback on the on the freshman team and then I was playing wide receiver and some defense on the sophomore teams. Dorsch is now an associate professor at Utah State but he remains active by running triathlons. The triathlon was really cool in the beginning because it was like every day I went out I was getting better and better and and that was fun. That was fun for me. So yeah that got me through grad school and, and we're still doing it not as much now with two little kids running around the house but um, but that's that's sort of our competitive fire and passion now. In Bozeman, John Miller, MTN Sports.